inner joy our sister who fell in love with jesus who became one with him in the is close to my heart to the heart of every jesus you are celebrating her wholeness you are celebrating her love with jesus i know her as a jesus youth pastor animator from 2010 till her death i had the singular privilege of traveling with her i remember in 2013 She was anointed in the Teens Ministry of Ernavalam as a member. I was there around saying the Holy Eucharist and anointed her and the team. Spent a little time with them and especially with her. And I was also privileged given the grace by the Lord to anoint her in 2018. as all kerala music team member was sriyachan was the animator a singular grace given by the lord the last team of ajana in jesus youth movement all kerala music team najina traveled a lot with the teens team and the music team she enjoyed her life in christ in jesus youth movement she celebrated beautifully she was like an angel moving around with a smiling face never making much sound but she was around she was there for all the programs all the workshops music workshops teens workshop like salt and light first years gathering music workshops in for the different programs and she was on the stage praising the lord as a king of arjuna the words of saint paul is ringing in my mind saint paul wrote to galatians chapter 4 verse 19 i am a child but my children i want christ be formed in you this my birth pain this my real pain and we see the ajna as the same with birth pain to form christ in many youth whether in teens team whether in music ministry whether in campus of sh college different campuses she has traveled a lot she was there for all the programs always behind the curtain always before the lord raising the hands very silently sitting with children helping 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 them to know jesus listening to their stories listening to their painful life experiences and encouraging them in their studies in their life in christ in jesus youth ministries she, she was a true disciple like christ like other disciples formed many that style of jesus youth too she imbibed it she made it in her life a very silent a silent missionary every jesus youth is a missionary and that was the catch word of uh, jesus youth during jubilee every jesus youth is a missionary a pit film missionary and ajna took it to her heart she thought of manifold missions in that side especially in ss college she has taken a lot of initiatives to give creative color to the missions she was part of uh, youth going to the general hospital somebody singing with the cancer patients serving them you with the food making them happy she was traveling around the college maybe some colonies bringing the peeping people to college every every month giving them some entertainment some joyful moments to experience in their life there's a government school close by she used to take the poor children who are poor in studies taking them to the college 
and together with other companions taught them and made them infant in the studies she was taking the buggers in the street bringing them to the college and having the beautiful time with them and had the risk to take them to the metro metro travel or to, to the lulu mall or different malls around ernakulam a beautiful moment and beautiful evenings with the with the poor and the disabled she was a true missionary in heart a true jesus youth missionary the gospel of john jesus says i am the bread of life who will comes to me will never be hungry this became the catch word of ajna all throughout her life in childhood been in teenage and in the campus you have seen her in the church often before the eucharist she never she will never miss a mass she was there singing for the eucharist she was fond of it silently adoring the lord during adoration a true lover of the eucharist when at the last point of her life when she was even struggling with cancer fighting with it it was during the time of covid even there was there was lockdown she used to look for the church which is open and take the scooter and go to the church and receive the communion she never missed a mass even during this lockdown period it's a miracle even when her face was disfigured because of cancer she was losing her sight she was losing her hearing on side she was not able to speak but she made sure to walk through the church be with the faithful and receive communion and she was fighting for it even with in the family preparing her for eucharist was not easy taking long time for preparation but she got up early prepared herself dressed herself made herself ready and with her mother traveled every day to receive communion a beautiful angel a beautiful person who loved jesus in the eucharist and till the last day of her life she received communion and went to the lord i have kept my faith i have fought the good fight i have finished the race saint paul writes to timothy in second letter chapter 4 verse 1 i have fought the good fight i have kept faith this is ajna we the final phase of her life extra ordinary virtue that she practiced the supernatural virtues of faith hope and charity it's so beautiful we cannot explain why how only thing god was with her that we know there are times naturally we think of we can lose faith we can lose hope we can lose even love because she was such a way fighting with cancer she was losing sight she was not able to eat anything she was not able to speak she was losing the hearing but at every moment there was a smile in her face whenever we approached her she made us happy never complained she was telling me god is providing her with everything what she needed the friends the time to go out and enjoy the sea show 
the company of good people to sing and dance everything god is giving then why she was telling i'm happy an extraordinary woman a child who practice extraordinary faith i have fought the good fight ajna was a true disciple and an apostle who experienced the passion and death of christ in her body she beautifully enjoyed it like every other disciple like saint paul and saint peter and other disciples ajna was a true missionary disciple filled with the holy spirit who tried to give christ to many to her activities to her travel to her singing to her different manifold creative missions ajna was a a heroic woman who, who lived the christian faith the virtues of faith hope and charity to the maximum even to the last moment of her life even in pain smiling happily enjoying the lord receiving communion real heroic woman ajna was a true daughter of the church and the love of jesus christ